Hey, what's up everyone, Ultimate Atomic HD here and today we're continuing the let's play of Travis Strikes Again No More Heroes. We're at part 10 which could very well be the finale of the series because my suspicions are... Yep, I suspected that behind this door is a boss and thus the gateway to finishing the semi-final game. <laughs> That's nice. Yeah, it's like they're having their old buddy talk. <laughs> All right. Yeah, I actually like this boss the best, like they are, I mean yeah the first boss, the electric thunder tiger was also kind of similar as well, but you know, it's like they're good old buddies and they're doing this for fun. So okay, so eight hearts. So that's the boss's name. He has four health bars. Damn, that's overkill. No, no, no. no. Okay, depending on how fast I actually destroy him. I could finish the whole let's play in this episode or the next. If this isn't the finale, then the next episode is 100% gonna be the finale, by my estimate. Okay, very close to finishing the game. Almost there. Ow, 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 no, no, no. Well, that wasted my charge because, yeah. Oh, it's Garcia. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, he spawns enemies. That's the first time for a boss to actually spawn additional enemies. And why are these things helping me so much? Okay, almost done. There we go! And done! The sixth game is done. I indeed do win. This should be an S rank. Yep. Only the fourth game I had on a B rank because, yeah, that boss is still my least favorite, the Smoking King. Alright, three minutes in. This is, go uh, this is really good in terms of our track record and circuit time. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Big boner. <laughs> I 
It's, it feels like uh, Sonic and the Black Knight on a more extreme note. And also apologize for... I apologize for uh, not recording yesterday. Uh, I had some troubles with, in, uh, with the internet which delayed the previous episode massively and yeah, it was not a pleasant time but I think I might actually record two episodes Providing that this isn't the final one, but I, I'm pretty sure that this will be the final one. I'm really not sure. Sure, I have one one whole other game to uh, go through, but I have this sneaking suspicion that it's gonna be rather short, like the fifth game. Or that it's not gonna be a game at all, instead we're going to simply do the final bit of the game RIL RIL IRL Thank you bosses These are my favorite bosses so far in terms of character there he goes! Oh, there's the sheep man again. Still have no idea what he's supposed to be. Time for another skill chip, which I doubt I'll use. Let's see what it is. Crossbone chip. Alright, that's another trophy for moi. Okay, time to time to go over the final motorbike section. After we, after our brief monologue section, once more. Ah, there we go. Let's see what Travis has on his mind. Something happened? What exactly happened? Oh! The six dead balls are combining! <laughs> it's a Dragon Ball reference! How could I have not seen it coming? Yeah, what? Yeah, this is supposed to be a reference to Shenron from Dragon Ball Z. I didn't wish for anything. There's a fake ball. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? Oh, it's Batman now. The dog is bad girl? I mean, it's... I, I'm not surprised, particularly, because assassins have come back to life previously, like Destroy Man and Let's Shake, but... 
The one part in where I wasn't surprised is because when I bought the third game, she was on the cover, and yeah, that kind of ruined that surprise. And yeah, she was on the cover in her human form, so I'm guessing that whatever we'll be doing for the final part of the game is reverting her back to the human form. But yeah, there was a whole blank part where in, where in the sticker pile where we where it shows the death balls that you have. So I was expecting that there will be a secret 7th Death Ball to really go home with the Dragon Ball reference. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Okay, what now? <laughs> there she is! Yeah, I... Yeah, it is time for the next motorbike sequence, that part is true. Okay, so the final part of the game is transforming bad girl back into a human. Bit... a bit anticlimactic, I really... <laughs> She's even called bad dog. Her spirit is the same, but she's cute in her own way. So, I'm kind of guessing, yeah, I also saw Batman on the cover for the third game, so I'm guessing Batgirl and Batman become mainstays in the gang, just like Shinobu has become. Alright, I have some time. Let's get, let's get myself a, a t-shirt, a new one. We have money for one. All right. Yeah. See, there, there's. It's like there's supposed to be a seven dead ball in the seven game, but apparently there's not. Can I level up? Nope. All right. On to the motorbike I go. I wonder if Bad Girl is still mad about how I killed her in the first game. All right. This should be the last bike section, so let's get it over with. Quark Gluon Plasma. <laughs> there was an episode about it in uh, of in the Big Bang Theory yesterday, which is kind of funny as well. Okay, so the foreshadowing. Oh. I was just about to say, because he has that weird eye thing uh, that the foreshadowing about Uehara was gonna be proven true and that he is the bad guy. Yeah, that's what I'm saying! Yeah, that's... Oh, okay. Maybe I was right. Okay, am I actually gonna fight him, or is this gonna get settled in this? Best out of five? <laughs> They're just exchanging happy slaps, and I'm here watching it. Graham. Graham Norton? Nah, not really. Maybe on young Graham Norton. <laughs> what was that? Threat level very low in Heroes of Mind and Magic 5? Okay, so it's apparently a gauntlet, so there's this guy now. You 
you you can of course always pause this if I'm scrolling too fast. John McAllister. Okay, so what was this about the best of five? So do I need to defeat five opponents? These two included? So after this one, there's three to go. You know, it would be much more efficient and, uh, you know, entertaining if you uh, give me actual gameplay for this. Oh wait, actually the tiger that was granting the wishes uh, mentioned that one of the death balls was a fake. Maybe this last one will be the last real one with the actual... Oh, could be the one for the fifth game be the fake, the, because yeah, that game was over super fast. So yeah, this is basically food for thought essentially. And see where it goes. I was kind of maybe... I, I was maybe thinking that that girl could get in these sections and talk just like Jean. <laughs> what was that? Okay, please do, I'm quite lost. Wait, that's it? Oh, okay. <laughs> that's opponent number three done. Fourth assassin. Who is it? A very stoic, three-eyed man. <laughs> he looks so funny with that hole, but yeah, it's not even a hole in his head, it's just his hair. Can you actually replic replicate something like that in real life? I don't think so, but it would be really cool if you could. There goes the fourth one. Time for assassin numero five. Yeah, final assassin and it's Suehara. Oh yeah, so there were seven death balls. I knew it. So I guess that's the main plot of the game. The main plot was basically Batman and Travis kind of gathering the dead ball so just so they could bring back Batgirl to life. Also known as Charlotte. Uh, and that's how what her actual name is. But yeah, I gotta get used to calling her Charlotte. Is it now? Oh, there goes his eye. All right. Yeah, crying is like a very unusual thing. It's like a healthy thing to do because you're basically letting out all your bottled up emotions, but 
on the other, you don't feel comfortable doing it, like... You, you feel comfortable doing it either when you're completely alone or in front of a very select few people, and that's what's kind of unusual about it, and uh, at the same time... Wait, do we have the dead ball now? Oh, it's the other bishop. Who is the technician? Do I get to finally meet Dr. Juvenal? So the death ball won't is kind of busted and we have to fix it. Okay, these these sections are getting kind of lengthy. I would appreciate if they weren't such Is it Wii Bowling? I'm your man if that's the game. Alright. Okay, so it's not Dr. Juvenal. Okay, so he has also made the dead balls. I don't know if it's by himself or with Juvenal's assistance or I, I don't know. Is it done? Yay! Thank you! Same too, even though I have absolutely no idea what the point of that earlier fight was. Alright, now let's skedaddle out of here and finish this game already. Because the more and more this goes on, the more and more the hype for the third game arises. Oh, your juvenile's dead. Nice little family business in a way, creating these dead balls. Uh, oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, I was just about to ask that. Wait, what? System shut down, what the hell?
What happened? Is it actually going to turn off the... To be continued? How? Okay, I got the trophy CIA, so I'm thinking that's the last game I have to play. Yep. Let's save up. And why did it say on the bike section to be continued? I thought this was the last game. I just hope that the final part of the game and the final cutscenes aren't locked behind the bike section. But anyway, onward we go to the last game, CIA. This ball is a prototype and... Okay... It doesn't even let me select a playable character. Yeah, this could be another very bite-sized game, just like the fifth game. Well, that was brief. Oh boy. I was right. Shapes and colors all around without any sort of cohesive binder. Oh, joy! Is this is the real world? That doesn't... Wait, wait! That's the bottomless pit! Wait, will these guys run off? I can just stay here! Well, almost. Yeah, these are piss easy, so... Not too bad. Okay, there's a spawner here. Oh, there we go. I need all these bug boys. I need the spawner. Come on. And there goes my battery. Nice! Fantastic action. Yeah, this game is largely... Wait, no! Uh, come on, I jumped! I'm jumping, dammit! Oh, for... No! Oh, come on! Thank you, Jesus! Nice! Love the tiger! A shame he only appears when this meter is charged to the max, and damn it! I do have to make bottomless pits here. Ow. Ow. Stop shooting at me, I'm trying to heal up. Come on. Nice. No, 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 no. Nice. Oh, 
This is cool. Oh, I run out of batteries. Why do they have to throw bottomless pits into the mix? That's so not cool. There's a mini boss! There's straight up a mini boss with no introduction. Is this one of the previous ones or is this a new one? Because it kind of looks like I saw him earlier. Yeah, he's white. No, 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 no! No! Suddenly I'm getting dogpiled. No, no, no. Ow. Come on. Ow. Let's heal up a bit. Not sure how if that damaged him in any way. Come on, just a little bit. Yay. No, no, no. Come on. You're a lot tougher than earlier. Is that by design or... Come on! Finally. And, la and at last, there's a toilet where I can ease my frustrations and relax and save up my progress. Will health fully restored? Um, okay. Arcade cabinet. Please insert one of the 50 blessings medals to load. Okay, I have no idea what this is. Oh, there's a toilet again, right here. What's the point of having these toilets so close to each other? Well, I don't know. At least they're not starving me for toilets. Oh uh, yeah, this is gonna be a mess. Damn it, I can't see shit. Ah, thank god. Ah, oh, the big bug. The Zucker bug, yeah, that's what he's called. Yes, there we go. There we go. Eliminated him. The spawner out of the way. Come on, come on. Got the spawner out. Come on, come on. Yes. This is very inventive, though, with the whole screen blocking. Oh, no. Come on. Oh, I wanna. I wanna charge! Keep pressing the freaking charge button, but it won't let me do it. Come on, I can't see anything. Where are all these? There's another spawner up there, isn't it? But yeah, there, there, there's a bastard here. Yes, there we go. Finally. Let's heal up. Let's, let's charge up. There's another spawner somewhere. What's this? Fifty blessings, but that's needed for the arcade game. 
Do I need to do something with it? I thought that was something purely optional. Clear up my screen. Go. Ow. Okay, I gotta be honest, this is starting to irritate my eyes. Like, I really don't, don't like this the more I keep looking at it. Yeah, another spawner. Spawner, I'm coming for you. There we go, tiger it up. Yeah, I can't go anywhere else. I gotta go back to that arcade machine and do something with that metal. R really? I just mentioned it earlier in the last play. There it is, Hotline Miami. Yeah, these are all the same. Ca yeah, I haven't played Hotline Miami for the record, but I did see uh, Johnny's review on it. So yeah. And I do know about it being a very messed up and nonsensical game. When it comes to the story. Okay, am I actually gonna play anything or is this just for the cutscene? I'm guessing there will be other arcade games with similar game references like this. This is really cool, to be honest. And especially if you're a fan of these games which will be referenced or are referenced, I'm imagining that you are having a time of your life uh, when, when you discover things like this, especially the part in the previous episode where Croatia was just randomly mentioned. It was really made my day because, as you all know, or at least when, when you found out in the last episode, I am from Croatia, not the city that they were going to, but I'm closer to the capital of Croatia when it comes to, yeah. Okay, I guess I won't be... Yeah, this is very reminiscent of these stains on the floor of Hotline Miami. Okay, I'm guessing I need to eliminate all these spawners. Okay. The view is much better this time around. Yeah, this sm these small fry are my favorites to get here. Come on, I just walk over you. See the drill bugs. That are gonna rue the day, no doubt, when I get to them. Oh, the spawner's gone. Oh, damn it! Yeah, these are gonna be a nightmare to fight against with this god awful gimmick. Yeah, I'm actually reminded also of Mega Man X6 with this, with the, you know, the nightmare effect. God damn it, stop that! Messing up with your view and all that. Go oh, much better. I'm guessing I need to follow these in order to find the spawner. Oh, I see them already. Did I kill you? Nope. 
course I did. My health is running a bit low. Let's clear up the stream, thankfully. Now I see. That's... How many spawners? Three? Now that I've eliminated... There are four of them, I think, in total. This large guy with the sword needs to go ASAP because I really can't stand them. At least I'm healing up so much. Come on! And there's... This guy doesn't know when to give up. Finally! Got him. Thought I was outside. I thought... I heard like weird screaming and I thought that it was in the game, but no, it's someone outside being a dumbass. Oh, there's the ramen man! Yeah, another spawner nearby. Yeah, there it is. Can I see the toilet as well? There are two spawners as well. Go, go. Indeed. Yeah, why am I wasting time with you? I can just ignore you. Okay, there's the Azteca coin. Oh, it's already been 41 minutes of recording. Time does fly when you're having fun, after all. Oh, come on! Stop that! There's nothing I hate more than being juggled. Oh, there's a spawner. Okay, fall back. We charge. Come on, kill it. Kill it! Then I need to go get help from the ramen man. Where's the ramen man? There's the there's the toilet and the ramen man. Let's go get the. Uh... Are you kidding me? This sucks. This sucks so bad. Okay, this will have to do for now. Master does not. That's what kicks me out of the healing ring. Okay, I need to switch. I need to switch. I can't switch with Batman. Oh, shite. Shitey balls. This is not good. Ah, come on. Yes, come on. No, 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 no. I thought I could switch with Batman again, but apparently I can't. Hey, this guy's left. Come on, kill him. Kill him! Make him bleed! Stop blocking! Ah, oh, finally! Thank God! Muff Muffin Man. Ramen Man, save me. Why can't I interact with Ramen Man? This guy's still after me. Clear this up. Come on, Ramen Man. I can't interact with Ramen Man. This is not good. And at least use the... To no, I can't. The pathway is blocked off. 
Why can't I use your services, ramen man? There's one spawner left. Let's see how to get there. Yeah, I know, it's straightforward. Okay, I'm actually waiting for the healing skill to become available again, which... Yeah, it's refilling extremely slowly. Why doesn't the healing skill refill? Okay, here goes, this is a huge gambit for me. Especially now that I missed the first skill. Okay, there we go. Heal up while I take care of the spawner. Yes, come on. There we go. Nice! Oh, thank god, that was a... Uh... That was some intense exercise. Okay, now time to pay a visit to Ramen Man. Come on. And the toilet. No, not here. Ramen Man! There we go, finally. Itadakimasu indeed. I really needed this. This might be our final visit to the ramen man in the series. Ah, oh, so sweet. Okay, before I can use the toilet, there's another mini boss. And yeah, and a shitload of enemies. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Of the small fight to charge up the rush meter. There we go, the mini boss is done. There's only the small fry left. Oh. I'm running with no juice, I haven't noticed it. This is rather laid back. Not that I don't mind, of course. Jesus, how long is this gonna go on? I realized there that I quoted Sonic from Sonic 06. Okay, thank god. Use the toilet. And I'm actually gonna end this episode off here, or maybe... Maybe that might not be such a good thing because... The finale could be like... Two or three minutes long. Um... I really don't know. But you know what, I'm a I'll actually end the episode off here because I, in I will actually do the very next episode right after so it doesn't impact the whole uh, it doesn't impact a whole bunch i will level up travis now there we go level nine and yeah uh next time is definitely gonna be the finale of the series since this episode wasn't so thank you all so much for watching stay tuned for more bits workers and updates have yourselves a great day and i will see you all next time